right, so we've packed our bag and a man can fit in the same size bag as a woman in this carry-on bag that's gonna go in the overhead compartment of an airline. Now we're gonna look at the backpack. So the first thing I'm gonna put in my backpack is I'll put my iPad in. It'll go in the pocket here made for computers. If I had sermon notes, they would go in there as well. Any team notes, they would go in there as well. My makeup bag. I'm gonna put my dual voltage hair dryer. It has adapters in it, also a travel brush in it, and a few other items, a teasing comb, that kind of thing in it. It's gonna go in my bag. Next, I'm gonna put my electronics in. So I wanna show you something that I purchased several years ago. Apple makes adapters for your plug. On the larger plug, You'll notice how this part of the plug will slip out. Well, they have adapters that can be used for various parts of the world, Europe, England, other parts of the world that simply adapt and slide right into your Apple adapter. Um, perfect little tool. You don't have to bring more adapters with you, but uh, just this one piece is sufficient, and so this is a good buy. I really suggest that if you travel a lot, you consider getting one. So I would put whatever adapters that I'm going to take on my trip into my electronic uh, bag. I also have a rechargeable battery for my phone or iPad in here, some wipes to clean the screen of my electronics, my earplugs are in here, an extra pen's in here, and a travel flashlight is in here. That's gonna go into my larger pocket of my backpack. I'm gonna put it in some sunglasses. I have my passport. It's gonna go in the front pocket where I can easily have accessibility to it. I have a change of clothes because when you're traveling overseas, sometimes you're, you've got two different stops. You go to one point in Europe before you go on to the next place of your destination. So it's always good to have a change of shirt, um, undergarments, socks, deodorant that you can get to. I take with me a little travel folding backpack. It's not as large as this, but when you're walking around the streets, like in Malia, my water bottle can go in here. If there's any tools that we're using that we're giving out on the street, anything that needs to be carried, this is a great little backpack, folds up. It can go in here. I take a extra pair of eyeglasses because if I was to break mine, I cannot read a thing. Wipes, again, for my electronic screens. They go in here. There's a place for a pen. I have another accessory bag. Let me show you what I have here. It has soap in it, but I keep travel washcloths because I have found that in most places of the world, they do not provide washcloths when you're in hotels. I do not know why. It seems to be a Western thing. And so I'll take some travel washcloths. These are the kinds that you get at the dollar store for kids. I can leave them behind. They're small. They can just get dropped into a suitcase, dropped into a backpack, very easy. Don't take a lot of room. There are other choices that you can use for a washcloth. These little pill washcloths open up to about Oh, maybe a foot long and eight inches, six inches wide. They're good to be used a couple of times and then they get thrown out. These can be purchased at a sporting goods store. You could probably go online at Amazon and also find these. The third choice of a washcloth that's easy to travel with and can be washed by hand and hung and dried is a linen washcloth. Those are three types of washcloths that I have traveled with. I'm gonna put my toothbrush in here because I wanna be able to get to it. This travel bag is gonna go right here. I have a water bottle that I can fill up at the airport, take with me. 
I take a bag that has my vitamins in it, has any medication that I need to bring with me. Electrolytes can go in here. I fill up a, a old bottle from Tylenol with a variety of aspirin, Tylenol, Advil, sleeping aids. Um, that might be needed. I keep eye drops because the planes have a tendency to dry out your eyes. Um, so there's something to lubricate my eyes. That's gonna go in the front pocket because I wanna be able to have access to that. Lastly, because I'm gonna be in two climates, I want to show you a coat that I purchased. I love this coat, it travels well. Um, I can travel in weather about the mid 30s into the 40s with this. It's plenty warm, especially if I'm layering it with a light sweatshirt. Plenty, plenty warm. I've been in cold climates using it. I also keep a scarf with me so that both in a culture like Malia where, or, or Morocco where I might need to cover my head because it would be appropriate in a um, Orthodox or strict Muslim area. I have a head covering and also for warmth. And then this simply rolls up just like you would roll up a sleeping bag. And this will go in my backpack. It also can serve as a pillow when I'm flying because it's soft and cushy and good support for the neck. That's going to go in my backpack. I still have room in my backpack. Last thing that's going to go in is my purse. I use a purse called the Bagalini. I have them in a couple different sizes. I use this one or one just a little bit bigger. I like them because they're lightweight. They don't take a lot of space and they're not heavy and they're also washable. And that's always good once you've returned from a trip because you've got all kinds of bacteria on it from lying on airport floors and other places. So my backpack's done. There's still space in here, so when I'm traveling, I can also put my sweatshirt in that I'm traveling with. Let me show you what I'm gonna wear. Usually when I travel, I wear a pair of jeans that are comfortable, a comfortable shirt, and of course a jacket for the plane, and good walking shoes. I like Skechers because they can be thrown in the laundry when we're done traveling, and all the gunk that they picked up can be washed away. And so that's how I do it. That's how Gale Buse can travel for up to six weeks or two months overseas, two different climates, with a travel suitcase that'll fit in the overhead and a backpack.